course, you've had some great, great success over the last couple of years with the the national team. You guys are in the midst of um, World Cup qualifying. As a little, like, talk to us a little bit about that experience for you over this last couple of years and uh, your first World Cup qualifying experience. Yeah, man. Like, I've got this question a lot from people just saying, like, oh, your national team is – you guys are looking good right now. And, like, it, it looks like right now, like, it's it's something special. But, like, obviously, you guys, it's it's not – like you guys have seen it for the past couple of years. Like, yeah. This isn't something that just happened, you know, like it, we didn't just walk into qualifiers and we were a good team. Exactly. So like, I think, I think from the start of, of John coming in and like bringing guys in and, and people starting to want to come to national team camp and be a part of it. That's kind of when that whole mentality of man, like this could be a special group started yeah. happening. And that was my first camp in Spain with like, with also with Ash, uh, with everyone. What, what year was that for you? Your first was 20, two years was ago? 18, 2018. Oh, yeah, two, that's what, two, three years ago. Okay. And it was in Spain? And, yeah, it was in it was in it was in Spain. Okay. Um, and I think even there there was a little bit, like a little bit like, oof, like yeah. there's some players. There's some players. Yeah. And obviously we've grown throughout the years and, and, and got better and, and played bigger games and won bigger games. Mm-hmm. But nah, man, like to to see the growth and to see the the transformation of the team and the progression of the team, like so rapid, yeah, like crazy to be a part of. Um, but to also like kind of like step back sometime and like see it, it's like, holy man, like, bro, it's sick, bro. Like playing in big games and big yeah. stadiums and big occasions, like it's it's cool, man. That's dope, cool. bro. Yeah, because even like I remember watching and um, you guys had the Gold Cup, not even having a full strength squad, and I. I remember texting Ash and I saw you playing against the U.S. I'm like, bro, Liam is like finding himself, bro. I'm like, I love to see, love to see, bro. That's awesome, though, man. Yeah. So, how has it been, bro? How was uh, the games in uh, the Mexico? How was that for you, Azteca? It was a crazy experience. Like, uh, I went there with TFC in 2018 as well for Champions League, and I didn't play. And so, I think just having like you guys know it's football there's like there's always like stadiums it's like the mecca of football yeah and like zero is one of them like for me wembley is one of them but aztec yeah. is one definitely of course. and even to play just 15 20 minutes there it was just like holy like like it just gives you it just gives you a bit more of like you want more you keep yeah. wanting more and so i think that's that's like the addiction to football for some people like including me it's just like there's always that one more like like experience you want or like feeling you want and that was one yeah. of them chasing so it was awesome bro. Bro, you almost awesome. you almost scored in that one as well. that too, bro. Yeah, oh my god bro i was jumping out of the, off the couch bro. I, was like, <laughs> yeah, oh. <laughs> I thought you know i really thought bro. yeah that was good though man no and then obviously you guys came back to how how's that environment at home it's crazy like, it's yeah crazy. that was sick i got to be there bro. it was unbelievable it's crazy bro like i i honestly well without a doubt it was the best atmosphere for a national team yeah game. Yeah, in in the history of Canadian football, 100%. um, but like that was just mad. Like it was mad. Like the the city came out. I heard that like the Leafs didn't sell out, um, yeah. but our game did, which was like thirty, was like thirty k or whatever. Yeah. And I was like, man, like people are really, really taking notice as they should. Um, yeah. But I think to go there, put that performance there too, that was like such a big step. Bro, that was a big step, man. That was a great night, bro. Great. Great to see, and obviously scoring the big four goals at home, like awesome. well, I was crazy. crazy. Like, kind of like written it better, you know. Honestly, yeah, exactly, exactly. I think that's just getting a lot of more fans in behind the squad, and hopefully, now in Edmonton, just exact same thing. That's all exact it is. same thing. <laughs>